Hello there everyone, Ash and Flash here and welcome on into a very interesting video. We've got a vlog, an actual Ash and vlog, rare occurrence. Um, it's a little bit short because I'm gonna be honest with you, I feel really uncomfortable, I'm not quite there yet to have my phone out and record all this stuff, especially for the mask. We just got out of lockdown, so anyways, I want to talk about this. Every stream I go on, one of the questions I get, at least once a stream, not even kidding, is will there be Zack Snyder Justice League cut? sets and the answer to that question you will find out today the, the answer is no but i want to show you why this set here the battle of atlantis set number 76085 this set came out in 2017 for 1999 usd and 2499 canadian i'm going to show you that this set is still on shelves to this day it is 2021 and this 2017 set is still on shelves and my goal is to go to Toys R Us today, find this, pick one up, because um, I, I may or may not have been digging out all of the uh, sets to do reviews for next week. Maybe we'll do them in black and white, the real way to watch the Snyder Cut. <laughs> um, but uh, I figured we would go ahead, hunt this down, and uh, you could see I got some dusting and building and stuff like that to do. And uh, so why not pick this up? Anyways, let's uh, transition. All right, so I've been talking this up for a while now that uh, they have Justice League sets still on shelves because of the Snyder Cut. Everyone's been saying, are we gonna get any? I'm like, they still have them on shelves. And for the first time ever, it's on sale here. I haven't seen it on sale before. And this is a 2017, 20, 2017 set. It's still here. It's the oldest set here. Like there's no other Justice League sets. These are pretty old. Like this is pretty damaged, but like look, and look at all of them. There's so many of them. All right, so as you saw, obviously, mission accomplished. I was able to acquire the Battle of Atlantis set on sale. Um, I would never buy this set full price. I actually, like I was saying earlier, I was digging out the sets, and I, I can't find some of the pieces for this one. Um, so I figured, you know what, it's on sale. Might as well buy it. I could sell that Arthur Curry or Aquaman, and uh, I figured it wouldn't be a big deal opening it up and it saves me from digging out the comic book as well I think it's in there so we're gonna do that and uh, I also picked this up because I forgot to order it on shop at home uh, the 4 plus uh, Iron Man versus Thanos set uh, that were launched on March the 1st so now I have this um, so there'll be a review out sometime soon you know what I thought why not interject this into the video because I thought it'd be fun when was the last time that you saw a 2017 set being opened up I don't even remember. I, I think, like I said before, I think this has a comic book, but I honestly cannot remember. Well, we've got the Parademon wings here that are folded. I guess the wings are fine, so that's good. Look at this. Ooh, that is in rough shape. Oh, there was no comic books back then. Oh, I must be mistaken. Oh, that's a shame. I remember comics. Maybe they're in the bigger sets? I'll have to dig them out. I, I thought that there were comics. Wow, that's in rough shape. Huh. No comics. Some sticker sheets, but uh, I'm excited. But anyways, um, we've got reviews and stuff like that coming out soon. So uh, on all of the Justice League sets, I don't know if I'll do it in black and white. I kind of want to as a joke. I kind of do. But uh, anyways, be sure to subscribe. Turn on the bell notifications so you don't miss out on those reviews. Uh, I will put a playlist here at the end if I remember of those reviews as well. As uh, I hope that answers your questions about whether or not we'll be getting Snyder Cut sets. We would know about it already. And also just like the set's still on shelves. And I saw the Flying Fox, I want to say at least last year recently. So that set didn't sell well either. The only one that I never saw recently was uh, the middle one. I don't even remember what it was called. The Crawler or whatever it was with the Flash. So that set I think was the one that sold the best. But uh, what do you think of this? Leave your thoughts. I want to hear them. Please, have you found any Justice League sets? And uh, if you're Lego watching this, please don't let this be an example of why we don't need Justice League sets. I promise. We'll buy them all right, chat. Right, right, comment section. We'll buy them all. Um, the, the Justice League movie, it just it didn't do very well. But if you give us more sets that aren't Batman-based, we'll buy them all. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I hope that you did enjoy this video. And I hope that you all have a great day. I will see you all in the next one.